Our top story this evening, two big updates regarding the COVID-19 vaccine. Thanks so much for joining us. I'm Alyssa Kratz. One group is now authorized for updated booster shots and another will no longer be required to get them. Fox 43's Harry Lee has the details. The Food and Drug Administration authorized the updated COVID-19 vaccine for kids as young as six months old. They can get either the Moderna or Pfizer shots, both updated to target the Omicron variant. The CDC says 95% of children ages five and under have not received a single dose of the COVID vaccine. The FDA says they're already working on the next vaccine update. These efforts include working with scientists to develop the next generation of COVID-19 vaccines with the aim of developing vaccines that provide broad protection against variants, including variants that we have not yet seen. Meanwhile, U.S. military service members may no longer need to get the COVID-19 vaccine. The U.S. House passed a massive spending bill to fund the Department of Defense for the next year. Within the 4,000 pages of legislation is a requirement that the Pentagon must drop its COVID vaccine mandate for active duty service members. Republicans called for the measure. Democrats said they only accepted it to get the larger bill passed. I don't like that, but it's much better than the poison that might befall us. White House officials say should the bill reach the president's desk, he'll consider it in its entirety. We believe that it is a mistake. Making sure our troops are prepared and ready for service is a priority uh, for uh, President Biden. The vaccination requirement for COVID does just that. Harry Lee, Fox 43 News.